Welcome back to The Sims 4 High School Years at Rags to Riches. Today, Rianne will find the true love of her life. It, it's today. It's got to be today. I thought it was last time. It wasn't. It's today. And I think it's Ranch. Or we can just call him Ray. I feel like he was a sweetheart, bookworm, neat, child of the ocean, no red flags, an adult, a little bit older, but that's okay. Brian I mean, Brian's nearly an adult too. As long as he doesn't suddenly age up into an elder, we'll be okay, because we, we we can work with that. It's 8 p.m., probably not the best time to go on a date or anything. Um, oh yeah, and you guys are saying I probably should change the picture of <laughs> Kevin. Uh, oh, Kevin. Kirk. I don't know why I always, I always call him Kevin. Uh, Kirk to uh, be Kenji. I, you know what? I'll keep this photo though. Quite fond of it. Let's put it over here. Might change the frame though. Go black. That's nice. <laughs> that can live over there. Alrighty. Well, my needs are pretty dang good. Might even get another gig. Ooh. The esteemed Estella Landgrab demands a flawless photo of Sims in a fashion pose. Okay. Sure. Wait, where is Kenji here? Oh yeah, Kenji is there. All right. What a uh, photo of a. Fashion studio backdrop. So we need to use this guy, which is fine. Let me just rearrange my studio a little bit. I got this construction quality concrete because I think if I change it, just get white, have like a flooring there, kind of. Yeah, what can we actually, is there any that we can set it to that doesn't look silly? That, I don't know. <laughs> Some of these are just kind of a little rough. Maybe cotton candy, let's do that. All right, where's my camera? Did I leave it outside? I did. I left it out in the snow. That's it. That's okay. I'll just drag it in. Oh, it's facing the wrong way. I actually move this further back, to be honest, so we can get a nice portrait photo. There we go. All right, take picture of Sim on subject mark Kenji. Oh wait, are you in? A, hang on. What do I? What do I gotta do? Oh, just fashion pose. Okay, you know what? Whoa. Okay, that light needs to be adjusted. Hang on. Uh, okay, it's a little bright though. The influencers always say I need more light, so maybe they're right. No, that's better. That, that's much better. Okay. But Brianne, how did you get stuck in there? That, that's not even possible. I'll just have to teleport around. She's about got stuck under the stairs. All right, there we go. Let's go take a photo. Oops. Yeah, this will be good. All right, we need a fashion pose. Fashion. Yeah, that's the one. Maybe a, it is maybe a little bright, I'm going to be honest. But, you know, we'll go with it. Oh, yeah, look at that. I mean, Kenji, what a model. Absolutely stunning. All right, is that enough? How many do I need? Oh, we got, we got enough. Okay, cool. Thanks, Kenji. You can go. Yeah, I need a, we need to earn a little bit more money so we can do, like, a little photo editing bay. And also, you know, actually furnish our uh, wardrobe. Because <laughs> that's kind of currently all very empty. And I have to use the lobby at the moment uh, for my office. Oh wait, no, the computer's later, sorry. Yeah, I have to, I have to send them off first. Uh, these kind of look worse in real life than when I took them. That one's probably the best, maybe. I'm gonna, I'm gonna send this one and maybe this one as well. There we go. And then, you know, I'm just gonna post these ones. Get some Simstagram fame. Hello, is someone rummaging? Th oh yeah, I was gonna say, is someone rummaging through trash out there? Uh, okay, this is a private property, Richard. What are you doing here? Okay. Maybe go say hi. This is private property, uh, but I will, you know, I will meet you so I can know your traits and everything. Hi, I'm Brienne. This is my photo studio. Uh, okay, that didn't go down so well. Oh, there we go. Uh, squeamish evil. Well, how are there so many evil people in my game? Like, honestly, <laughs> I swear we know so many evil Sims. All right, Brienne, let's go to the toilet. Let's go take care of our stuff. I honestly don't know how we know so many evil Sims. All right, let's get some leftovers. Let's get around to the morning because I do. Oh, photos approved. That's good. Uh, I want to get around to the morning so we can go see if we can catch up with uh, with Ray and see if there's if we're gonna hit anything off with him. Hey, um, Kenji, you can you can do stuff. In Wait, hang on. I didn't lock you out, did I? Let me just <laughs> let me just check. Everyone but roommates and then allow access to household. Just making sure. Okay, I might have locked that door because as soon as I unlocked it, Kenji seemed to come up. Sorry about that, buddy. There's a stinking mixing bowl out here. Oh, you're sad. What's up? Social bunny post. Do we even use social bunny anymore? Can I, I mean, I feel like I'm an adult now. I probably shouldn't be using that. I'm going to deactivate it. But that's a very teenage uh, thing. Let's get rid of that. Hey, bud. Oh, I'm going to clean up downstairs. Okay. That seems un... Okay. You didn't really clean up at all. You just put the plates over here instead. All right. Uh, clean up in the public bathroom. There we go. And then... Oh, there's a, a oh, dang half walls. I knew I, half walls, man. I'm I'm expecting to see stuff up here soon as well. I might sell these to publications, try and get some more fame as well, actually. Because we got to be close, right? We're so close to two stars. Come on. Oh, dang it. Didn't do it. <gasps> Postman. I mean, is that our front door? No, it's not. Shouldn't they have come through here? Hang on. I'm going to lock for everyone but roommates and allow access to household. I don't want random sims using that door. They should be using the front door. <laughs> the back. So that's good. The, the actual, the mailman comes all the way upstairs. That actually works really well. Sweet. All right, let's grab those photos. I'm going to assume that's my photos, right? Yep, there they are. Fantastic. Let's 
go and post that. Freelancer, post, uh, outstanding. Ooh, that one's $26, let's do that one. I'm also a little cold in here. Might get a thermostat to, to warmer as well. There we go. Yeah, that's better. And then let me just post that photo again because it reset. Oh, GeekCon. Oh, wait, we should take Ray to GeekCon. Gracie, you want to go to GeekCon? No. All right, $4,000. Very nice. All right. Now, uh, should probably, wait, what's my needs like? My needs are pretty good. They're, they're all right. Oh, let's change into really cold weather wear, right? All right. Then we're going to ask on a date, Ray. <laughs> I like how we have like four love interests so we can ask out on a date. Uh, it's a job agency call. It's a friendly reminder that there are plenty of gigs to work on. What? I know, I just did one. Okay. No, I'm trying to ask Ray on a date. <laughs> All right, GeekCon. Is GeekCon over in the fashion district or is it? I think so. Which is kind of weird that it's in the fashion district of all places. But if you say so. All righty. Here we are. Ray, what's going on? Oh. Wait, can I change it to a costume? Because there's a lot of people in costumes here. Is that like something I can just do? Can I buy a costume? I can buy a t shirt or swag, but. I kind of want a costume. All right, what are we going to do? Uh, sit and talk to my date. Well, can we do like some, not really many activities we can actually do together. Let's just go sit over here together. Uh, Ray, can you sit please? Ray, oi, the heck? Get back over here. Sit together, please. Oh, dang it. Okay, well, Ray really does not want to sit there. So, oh, dang, look at my outfit. I look good. Maybe we can go in here then. What if we go say sit here together? Let's go, let's go to the karaoke bar. Maybe we need a little bit of alone time with Ray. There we go. Look at that. Sit and talk. Friendly. Likes and dislikes. Get to know. Also, wait. What's your... Did, wait, did I find out your career? Library. That's where we saw you. I assume. I, I assume we saw Ray there at some point. <laughs> I don't know. But that makes sense. You're a bookworm. That's kind of cute. Favorite fashion. Oh, actually, if we can get... Wait. If we can get your actual fashion... Maybe we can give you a makeover. What kind of fashion are you into? Hmm. Oh, basic fashion, streetwear fashion. Okay. Write that down. Basic streetwear. Okay. I've written it down so I can do a makeover. Because we are definitely, you're definitely, I'm sorry, but you're definitely going to need a makeover. Uh, <laughs> what else? Taste in music, taste in decor, hobbies and skills maybe? What are you into? Also, we got to be a little bit flirty. So if you could jump off your phone, that'd be good too. You're into gardening or what, what, do you, what kind of things are you into, buddy? Uh, video gaming. Oh, hey, we're, oh, Vlad, what's up? Hey, Brian, I've been thinking about getting to know Scott Skinner better. Uh, yeah, you, you should hang out. Well, we're here at video gaming. Do you, want, do you want a video game together? Can we play multiplayer game? Party frenzy? That'll be cute. Oh, you was here too. <laughs> Wait, what is this? Ask Ray on a date. That, uh, we literally already did that. So I don't know what you want me to do about that. Can we go play video games together? Oh, uh, what? Apparently you couldn't get to the couch. Is there another sim trying to sit on it? I love, by the way, that this outdoor festival is still here in the snow and the couch is covered in snow. Uh, he doesn't seem to be able to sit on the couch, so I guess let's not do that. Freaking Darth Maul. Oh, it's Candle! <laughs> Dang you, Candle! Candle, big wallet. Alrighty, jump back in here. Let's get back in. No one's hanging out at the uh, the karaoke bar. Okay, did a little bit of flirty. Flirt with your date while flirty. Okay, that's a little bit more difficult. Yeah, I'll give you a romantic gift. I'll give you... Oh, basics! Yeah, he likes basics. He said basic streetwear. I mean, the outfit itself is tepid. I'm probably not very in, but... You said you like it. Hey, Ray, I made this just for you. Yeah. Oh. Oh wow, that's really nice. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Oh, okay. Okay, we're both feeling flirty. <gasps> Give my date a massage. <gasps> first kiss. So I never see the massage option. Well, hang on. If we're gonna do a first kiss, we gotta make it special because Brienne does not have many first kisses. <laughs> oh, can we? I mean, on this snowy bridge is pretty nice. We need someone to take a photo of us. We gotta pose. Build a snow pal together up here. I don't know that there's enough snow to build a snow pal together. But let's go here together for a second. Uh, Ray? Dang it. I think Ray's not very good at following. There we go. All right. This. Oh! Hey, Brienne. I, I got this for you. I really like you. That's sweet. Look at that. Isn't that nice? You know, this video's not as good as I thought it was because I didn't realize the fence was this high. Uh, not the best first kiss location. Let's just play video games together first. Then. Maybe now we can that Candle's not there anymore. <laughs> I still can't seem to do it. Okay, never mind. Uh... Ray gave Brienne a gift along with a romantic message. Oh, you are my heart, my soul, my treasure, my today, my tomorrow, my forever, my everything. Look, I don't want to be that guy, but that maybe is actually coming on a little too strong and that could be considered a red flag. <laughs> That's a little strong. This is our first date. We haven't even kissed. My everything, Ray? Come on. <laughs> now Brienne's is running away. Well, what if I just say sit together? I don't know. 
There we go. Look, now we can see it. Sure, surely we can play it together now. You like video games? Yeah, we're playing video games together. Let's go. Oh, hey, James Center. Oh, Brody. Hey, Brody. Uh, yeah, you're kind of blocking the screen. Oh, uh, James just kind of joined in. All right. Uh, okay. We weren't really invited, but that's cool. All right, where's the bathroom? Because Bree is really going to go. All right, that's enough of that. Gotta go to the bathroom. Hey, Kirk. I want to explore space with, um, with Ray, but I guess we can't. I asked to be boyfriend. Whoa. Okay, hang on. We haven't... Let's embrace at least. We haven't done a first kiss yet. I'm kind of purposely leaving that because... Oh, Vlad. How'd you go? Uh, you won't believe it. Chichiro uh, is such a sweetheart. I'm in love! Okay, nice. Oh. Vlad has found love. And in the meantime, maybe Brienne has found love too. That's all I'm saying. I mean, there's definitely sparks flying. I'm not running this show anymore. These things are just... Oh, now I'm focused. Okay, well, and you're happy. Well, there was sparks flying, okay? Is there anything else we can actually do together here? Oh, it's happy hour at the karaoke bar. Festival ends in an hour too. Can we can we play this together? No. Can't really, can't really do stuff together here except for play this video game. Let's talk about marriage. So, Ray, what do you think about getting married? Oh, whoa. Okay. Are you into it? <laughs> Rianne's autonomously telling Ray a story, which I think is one of our tasks anyway, so that's pretty good. I don't know, I feel like I feel like things are happening here. Even though, you know, Ray came in a little strong, Bree seems to like it. Date complete, gold medal. All right, see you later. I'm going home, because I gotta eat, actually. I gotta, I gotta get home. I'm now, I'm hoping that Ray asks us on a date or creepily shows up at my house and asks to be partners or something. <laughs> <laughs> it creepily stalks me. That, that I'm happy with that too. All right, we've also got a little bit of money. What well, do you want to go get some leftovers first of all? Now, I need to do a home office. Well, it doesn't have to be a home office. I need somewhere that Brienne can have like an editing studio. Oh yeah, I just wanted to do like the changing room thing, didn't I? So as we do have, we do have more room out back. Like we could set up other stuff. Let me let me build the, the wardrobe first because I feel like we need to do that. I feel like Brienne would have a huge light up here. For sure. It's kind of, that'll annoy me. That's kind of in the way. <laughs> I feel like Brown would have that, but it's in the way. Let's get these classic uh, Moschino lights. I love those. And then I'll just get some of these uh, little saucer lights. So it's very bright up here. Okay, we need this mirror that has like the shoe, the shoe view. Okay, we need a wardrobe platform, which I assume they step up on the back of it, right? Okay, there's a lot of windows in here, which I guess, do I just want to ignore windows or do we want to, do we want to work with windows? Probably work with, like, what if I did something like this? So you could like walk around that side of the wardrobe and then also this side. Now I'm just using these because they're kind of easier than doing the, um, the custom Dream Home Decorator ones because those kind of just disappear with the walls. And also they, they always glitch out when you use move up. Objects. I'm just gonna use these. And I think maybe we should do definitely need a different floor, like maybe a marble or something. That kind of looks like bathroom though. Where are the bigger ones? Could do that one, just like full. I don't even know how how would you even place this? This is like looks like one big piece of marble. <laughs> I use this one. Tiles, yeah. Let's do that. I feel like that mirror is not big enough. I think we just have to go for the regular, like this mirror. Not sure what to do about shoe, like this space here as well. That's kind of weird. But we can, can I get, oh, I can only afford two of them. That's all right, we can start with two. We definitely need like the, this, okay, this room, this room needs work, all right? All right, these are expensive. We need like the makeup chair and stuff in here as well, I think. It's kind of hard to know where to put stuff though with the, uh, the windows. But now we'll just do it like this. There you go. Look, look at this. Look how much stuff you got up here. Obviously, if you look closely, it's the same on both sides, but if you don't look too close, it's just a big wardrobe. I do some of this like along the wall. Oh, I ran out of money. I was gonna do like the whole wall there. I thought that'd look cool. Maybe I'll just light above. So it's like you get extra light on you. I mean, that's pretty good lighting. We definitely need more though. Yeah, okay. We're gonna do a lot more up there. <laughs> I've just spent all of our money. Uh, so we're definitely gonna need to do another gig as well. That's for sure. Let's get some food. Oh, you're gonna take it from that fridge. Okay. And we're eating in the lobby. All right. <laughs> And Kenji's, Kenji's cleaning up. I mean, I gotta say, Kenji is a fantastic roommate. I love him. Great guy. Very, very good. I'm very happy for you. Did he, did they ever get set up with Yua? No. Uh, who was I setting up with Yua? I was setting up, um, was it Tana maybe? Oh, no, no, no. I set up, I set, I set up Kirk. Oh, I tried to set up Kirk and Yua. That's right. Because they were both paranoid. I thought they might get along. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm going to see if I can take another gig. Maybe. A, oh, there's not a lot of gigs. Well, that's a high paying one, 7,700. Don't mind if I do. Chat with style influencer, alrighty. Just gonna go down to my lobby again. Oh, the other thing I really wanna do, we need to get some family photos you guys were suggesting. I don't know how well it's gonna work, but I wanna try inviting, well, I guess we should probably, we should get some of Kevin and Reginald, but I wanna invite Addison, Hillary, and their two kids and try and get them all in like family photos. I, I don't even know the kids. I think I have to go visit them actually. Let's do, let's do the pop-in actually, maybe tonight. Maybe we can go visit. Look, I'm thinking about Addison. Okay. 
Okay, cool. We'll, we'll sort out those photos later. Let's go over to Addison and Hillary's place, visit them, which I don't think we've actually done in this last play. Like we haven't, well, clearly I don't know their kids at all. Go visit my niece and nephew. Hello, it's me, Auntie Bree Bree. I see you in there. You're like a child now, and I don't think I've ever met you. Cheerful introduction. It's your auntie. Okay, you're still in your chef outfit, so you've clearly just worked. Okay, it's your cool Auntie Bree. You're outgoing, that's all, oh. What was it, the negative there? Here, what about, oh, hang on, where's my other, yeah, you, friendly, friendly introduction. Or not. Hey, Rye, it's your cool Auntie Bree. Or not. Do I know you? Try, I'm trying to meet Rye. There we go. Hey, Rye, it's me. Auntie, huh? <laughs> who's a use? You're scaring me's. Okay. I was going to play dolls with the Addisons in the way. All right, all right. Here, what about this? I know how to make you like me. Play. Okay, stop talking. Uh oh. Oh yeah, yeah, there we go. It's like, I don't want to play. Ah! 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 Well, you're gonna play, because I'm the cool Auntie Bree. Look at this, we're all growing together. I don't I think Addison's stuck. I might just uh, reset Addison. There we go. Hey, do you like me now? Oh, that did not help. Uh, check toddler. Do you, do you need anything? You want a faction? I, uh, not from you! No! Oh, that's so sad. Dude, this kid does not like you. Stop trying. Uh, here, what about if I give you a gift? I'm gonna give you a... Maybe not. <laughs> Auntie, cool Auntie Bree brought a voodoo doll. I'm gonna give you a voodoo doll. You can pass this down the generations. This can go to your kids and your kids' kids. Say yay! Poke, poke! <laughs> Uh-oh. Where's this guy here? What? Why are you here? Where are they? Outside? I don't want to talk to them. Leave me alone. Let me go talk to my niece. Ask about school. There we go. So, how's school? The kids, uh, do you guys learn stuff or? Oh god, I'm sad. What am I sad about now? Shared sadness. Ooh. All right, so you guys were saying, and you know, by the time you guys said this, um, even though this table says it's toddlers only, and uh, like, and uh, I think a child, or maybe a teen or older, has to build the stuff first before the toddler can play with it for some reason. And apparently it takes forever, so let's try to do it. Okay, I'm reading the instructions, okay. I didn't even finish, okay. Oh no, what am I gonna do? Why am I picking up this kid? This kid doesn't like me. Yeah, I'll play dolls with you. Maybe you'll like me then. There you go. Addison, and Hillary's like, Addison, get your sister out of here. She won't go home. It's like midnight. <laughs> yeah, I'll read you to sleep. There you go. I don't know if this kid needs to sleep or not, or they're hungry, or I don't know what they need, but I'm doing it anyway. Oh, I also haven't... <laughs> Yeah, uh, sorry Quinn, I haven't, because I haven't done the next part of this Let's Play yet. I haven't converted the bedrooms. So this, this is supposed to be Quinn's room, and this is supposed to be Rai's room, but obviously there's no bed in here for Quinn, and there's no toddler bed in here for Rai, so whatever. Not my problem. Okay, this kid did not want to sleep. Okay, bye guys, I'm going home. <laughs> Okie dokie, let's go to bed. <laughs> I'm pretty tired. And then tomorrow we can work on that gig and get a bit more money. Alrighty, let's go take a shower, go to the toilet, and then we gotta go use our new our new crib. Ask for outfit, change into costume, offer to, <gasps> offer to update appearance. Oh yes, that's actually pretty cool. Unfortunately, I've kind of locked this whole area off. So I guess I'm gonna have to allow other sims to come through here, aren't I? Oh, this is gonna be a problem, isn't it? <laughs> oh, actually what I could do, hang on. Lock for everyone but Briam. I could add another door here potentially, right? Oh, well, that doesn't help because I'd have to block off. I could move, actually, I could move the entrance of our apartment to here. Oh, I don't really have any money. Okay, never mind. Well, I do, yeah, using that for makeup is actually pretty cool. I guess I can just temporarily unlock it. So I can just get all these costumes here. <laughs> That's good to know. That's kind of, oh my gosh, wait. Should I ask for an outfit from Kenji? Let's see what, let's see what Kenji gives me. Yeah, let me go after, I'll go to the toilet first. Hey, Kenji, ask for outfit. I'm going to ask Kenji for a, Cold weather outfit. I unlocked that right, yep, cool. I mean, Kenji looks pretty- Wait, where'd you- Did you just bake a cake? All right, all right, Kenji. Show me what you've got. Give me the best outfit possible. All right, stepping up. Here we go. I'm expecting big things here, dude. Okay, getting measurements. Oops, sorry. Here we go, mm-hmm. Looking at the color palettes. Here we go. Whoa, let's go. Is that the- is, or is it gonna change a few times? I don't know how this works, I don't remember. I mean, I kind of like it, to be honest. It's a little bit of fun. The shoes are... Oh, I guess that's... Wait, what? Well, yeah, I guess that's it. All right, new outfit. I mean, does that... I assume it's just temporary, not actually one of my outfits. Is that how it works? So that's cold weather. Yeah, it's not actually one of my outfits. Okay, well, that's fun. Am I just gonna go eat a piece of cake? Yep, <laughs> I guess so. All right, I better lock that door before it becomes a problem. Hey, I got $719 from rent. Let's go. All right, now, Hillary does have a job, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to invite them all over today. Why don't we see... 
Hey Ranch, you wanna go on a date? I feel like we need to progress our, our social life. <laughs> you are our options. Rose, no. You're, well, first of all, Rose is an elder now. And also still has a husband. Uh, Tana, that was questionable. I I really like Ray. I'm I'm rooting for Ray. I just hope he doesn't disappoint me. Let's go to my my Shuno Meadows, the park. Nice snow covered park. Might be a beautiful place for a first kiss. Potentially. All right. Well, <laughs> should, should we have our first kiss under the wedding arch? Oh, how about up here? This would be nice. Let's go here together. Oh, Vlad. Uh, oh, you had a good time with Scott Skinner. Great. Okay. Can, can we go here together though? Like go here together. No, no, no. Ray. Ray. Come over here. Cl closer. Okay. Fine. I'll go here. Okay. First of all, let's uh, blow a kiss. Okay. Wh why are we sitting down? Guys. <laughs> all right. <laughs> oh, and, and also sitting at opposite benches too. Okay, this is kind of awkward. Um, ask a risque question. Yeah, and, and Ray's also looking at his phone. Maybe a little bit of flirting. I mean, it's a nice little, nice little snowy scene. Offer mas- oh, no, ask for massage, not offer. Ask if single. Ooh, that'd be maybe a deal breaker at this point. If you're not single, that'd be kind of awkward. I'm pretty sure we already checked that though, but yes, you are single. Okay, good. Okay, I need a joke with my dad a little bit too. How about we do a uh, funny story? Actually, I don't know if funny story counts as a joke. Joke, uh, knock knock joke, there you go. And tell a joke about penguins. Miho, Kane is asking me out. I don't know who you people are, but yeah, go for it. <laughs> I don't know who you are or why you're calling me, but sure. I'm on a date right now. I'm not the best time. Okay, I've done some jokes. Have a deep conversation. Okay, I'm feeling very playful. Let's make it deep now. Where do you see yourself in five years? Oh, we became good friends. Oh, wow. Even... <gasps> Oh, become best friends. Okay. <laughs> yes, of course. That's nice. Look at that. Ray taking the initiative. And now we're going to be flirty. A little flirty flirt. Wait. Oh, no. Okay, that ring. That's okay. That ring's not on his ring finger. That would be a problem. Could have been some baggage there, but it's okay. It's just a different ring. Hi, Ray. What's going on? A little flirty flirt. See, I'm very playful and you're just inspired. So it's not... Whoa! Uh, sir, what? This gazebo's occupied. This, this is supposed to be our romantic. I don't know if there's an old guy. Imagine if an old guy just came and sat down. Okay, no, get out of our conversation. Okay, maybe if we just ignore them, they'll go away. No, what are you? Stop talking to me. Back in my day, we used to do this in private. It's okay. It's my day now, says Bree, and we we don't care. You're in our space. It's the Zoomers' time to shine. All right, can we maybe? I don't want to do a first kiss with this guy right here. <laughs> he ruined my spot. <laughs> Uh, where can we go? We can go down here somewhere, maybe. What about over here? Oh, <laughs> there's a bar over here? All right, maybe not. And there's some dude playing the violin. Okay, maybe not there. Maybe here in this little garden. This looks nice. Let's go here together. Come on, Ray. Ray, this way. Now. <laughs> Don't know why I have to run around the long way. Uh, excuse me, sir. Oh, Kirk, you're gonna die. Kirk, no, Kirk. Change outfit, change outfit. Kirk, no. Please. Okay, there we go. All right, hang on, go here. Okay, now also Kirk, could you not ruin this moment? Thank you. Uh, no, 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 don't think about other people. Ray, you were the chosen one. Ray! Oh wait, he's coming back, we're good. <laughs> All right, first kiss. I mean, not really, oh, this is not, not what I want. I mean, it's still nice, isn't it? Here we go, let's see if Ray's the one. Hmm? Hmm? Okay, I feel like Ray's a little indifferent. You know, I mean, we've got a lot of romance between us though, so I think, I think that's nice. And I'm going to embrace now. I mean, that was a pretty nice date, except for that guy interrupting and also Kirk nearly dying. Okay, Kirk's doing push-ups now. There you go. Oh, and you're on your phone. He's like, and I got to post about that to Social Bunny. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Share excitement. What am I sharing excitement for? What is this? I clicked on Ray and it said share excitement. Or did I not? Did I click over here? <laughs> Let's ask about your taste in decor too. That's kind of important. What do you like? What do you like? Mission decor. Oh. Look, not great, but you know, we can work, we can work with that. All right, let's just see what they do autonomously now. I'm not going to do anything. There's still like some flirting or something going on here. Oh, see, look at this. Look, there's still some flirting going on between Brienne and Ray. Oh, now Brienne's on her phone. Pretty sure that's one of her fame quirks. Oh, what, what's our, uh, Ray is deeply connected. Uh, and so am I. And there's a jam-tastic gift. Brienne re um, remembers fondly of receiving a gift from, uh, Ray. She was even and canned and canned. I don't get it. I don't, what's the joke? And canned. Anyway, that's really nice. That means Brienne really liked the rose that he got her. That's so cute. All right, do you guys want to keep talking? Oh, here we go. Talking about tanks. So, uh, what do you think about tanks? Tanks are pretty cool. Yeah. Huh. <laughs> 
Yeah, I like bed. Bed's pretty good. I like sleeping. I like waking up. I like looking at the bed. I like riding. What do you think about riding? Oh, update server. Sorry, I gotta go. Let's just see what happens. Are we gonna... Oh, yeah, he's gone. Bye. Right. Well, he might show up at our place. All right, what I want to do, I want to go home. I think uh, Hillary finishes work at 5 p.m., so I'm thinking maybe we could get the family around. I have no idea how we're going to do, like, if you, can you even do, like, a family photo shoot? Is that even a thing we can do? Uh, I want to use this, so let me move some of this junk out of here. Move this into storage. All right. <laughs> how much is this thing? 100 bucks. I'm going to get another one. I'm going to get another one so it's a little bit bigger. Wait, why don't these line? Oh, that one's up on the platform, I see. There we go. I'm going to go white. Somehow, I don't think this is going to work, me trying to do this, but maybe I can get them all to sort of stand there somehow. That's my theory. All right, let me wait till like 5 p.m. Okay, now we say invite. All right, we're going to invite. Uh, hang on, let's go. Oh, let's... Why don't they have one for family? Co-workers? Clubs? Pets, house, but no, there's no, why is there no family filter? Okay, I want Addison, Hillary, Rye, and Quinn. Everyone is coming over, great. Why do I see this? Hey guys. Okay, bring it yep. Okay, now how am I gonna do this? <laughs> this seems like a recipe for disaster. Okay, let me, first up, let me actions form a group. All right, everyone go here together. Let's just stand in the general vicinity. That's my new theory. Oh, who put, who put pancakes up there? <laughs> All right, Kenji, can you get the can you get the broom? <laughs> How do they even do that? Why is there no limit to what they can put up there? Let's just put that uh, over here. All right, everybody. Oh, actually, that's not a bad spot. Okay, what if we go here a little bit? Yes. Okay. Can I say take picture of? Oh, hang on. Wait, I can say take picture carrying. Wait, carrying Hillary. Oh, okay. So Hillary can carry you, but then I kind of want everyone. I don't think I can get everyone though. That's kind of the problem. But that's cute. Not not quite what I'm after. I want to like the whole fam. Also, they're kind of slightly not looking at the camera. Go this way a bit more. Also, we're all wearing winter clothes, so it looks a little cold. I'm happy with that. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. So can I, is the limit actually three? Yeah, it's three overall, which is actually kind of annoying. Because I could, even if Rye was a child, I still couldn't do it. Okay, let's see if this, how this works. Okay, hang on. Rye is actually kind of there. Oh, you know what? Here we go. I mean, obviously it's not ideal because <laughs> Rye's just kind of there. But you know what? I say, oh, the outfits are kind of <laughs> we're all in winter clothes. But you know what? We gotta take what we can get in The Sims 4, okay? Right, let's try a different pose. Obviously, Rye won't change, but so I don't know where they're all looking. They're kind of they're, all three of them are looking at a different location. <laughs> the fashion photo. <laughs> oh, that was pretty funny. Okay, happy family photo. Look at that. Everybody smile. Whoa, now let's take a goofy one. Rye in the background, just still doing the same pose. At least Rye is in it. All right, let's just go with that. That's good. Thanks, guys. Whoa, slow down, slow down, slow down. Oh, gosh, the speed. All right, well, I got a bunch of photos, which I'm going to basically give to them, is my plan, because then they can use this in their house. Well, I want to keep, let's keep at least one. Let's see what we got. That's cute. All right, well, I want to keep, <laughs> maybe I'll keep this one for my studio, because that's a little bit of fun. And I'll keep maybe this more close up one. Uh, and maybe the fashion ones are funny. And then maybe I'll just gift all of those to them. So I'm just gonna, for now, pop some of these over here. Let's go add frame. And then we'll figure out the position a little bit. Oh no, not help cleaning. Oh, I actually, you guys suggested I should give them some of these, these photos of Hillary as well. I'm gonna give them, I'm gonna give them this photo so they can have that in their house too. And then we can put another photo down there maybe. Maybe we can move uh, Kevin down there. Yeah, let's move Kevin down there. I'll have to rearrange in build mode. Move Vashti over. Uh, yeah, I'll we'll play around that a second. All right, so all of these ones I'm basically going to give to them. Um, hang on, let me just dump out these other ones from my inventory. Just so I only have the ones I want to gift. All right. Um, friendly give gift. Friendly gift. Can I just give all of them? Do I, am I going to have to do this one by one? Oh, oh Quinn! <laughs> It's my photo studio. I don't know if there's a better way of doing this, but this is how I'm doing it. I mean, I guess I could literally just go to the house and put it in the house. Actually, that might be easier. All right, all right, guys, let's get out of here. Come on, <laughs> let's stop making a mess in my studio, please. All right, everybody in the car. All right, here we are. Now, I think I can just put it, like literally just put them in the house, right? Now, obviously I'm not gonna, <laughs> when, we, when I come back into this Let's Play, I'm not gonna put all these photos in this room. We will pick the ones we actually wanna keep uh, and we'll put them up somewhere. But I'm just putting it here so it's in their house and they should be able to, we should be able to customize that pretty easily. Also with growing together, they have the new frames coming, which are really cool. So hopefully those will work well with that. I'm, oh, should I should have taken, I probably should have taken smaller size photos too. So we had all the different varieties, but whatever. All right, that's all. I was just dropping you guys home. I was just trying to get rid of you. Okie dokie. 
<laughs> oh, dang it. <laughs> All right. Um, oh, you know what? Actually, that's kind of cool. You know, it's interpretive. Maybe I can get a cool photo of it. I don't know. Put it in inventory. I think that's like some cool artwork. Oh, yeah. This is like some abstract masterpiece. Get all the different sizes just in case we need it. Look at this. This is great. If I get a slightly different, whoa, slightly different angle, it might be better. Yeah, look at this. You know what? I think Quinn really did something here. <laughs> Let's see. Let's check them out. Yeah. Look at these. Sweet. That's, I mean, some of them actually not too bad, to be honest. Little ones. There we go. It's a bit of fun. All right. Can you, wait, what do I have to do for my thing? I have to, um, Sims in formal wear. That looks like formal wear. Let me just check. Oh, that's not your formal? Is that party wear? No, what, wait, what are you wearing? Wait, that's literally none of your outfits. All right, well, what your form, that's your formal wear? No, it's okay. I'll find someone else. You know what? Ray, I like you. I like you more than a, more than a model. Will you be my model? What's your formal wear? We might have to fix it, to be honest, but let's see. All right, what do you got for me? Um... <laughs> You're certainly a character, Ray, right? and you know what? I can't take that away from you. So do you want to go? <laughs> Wait, does it have to be? I think it's just anywhere, right? All right, ask to pose you, and then I'm going to move this further back again. Okay, my little check mark is gone, so I can't take a photo. Yep, okay, it's gone. Let's go to buy mode. Let's just hit save. Try again. There, it's back again. <laughs> I don't know why. Okay, I'm heading upstairs, and I'm coming back down again. Sorry about the delay there. All right, so we're going to get five photos of... Let's do fashion, though. Whoops. No, sorry, fashion. There we go. All right, work it for me, Ray. you got to show me what you're made of here. Hey, that's not fashion. Oh, I think what happens is if I change the size of the photo, it changes the, the pose I'm on. Let me see. So if I go small... Wait, no, it didn't. I don't know why it sometimes it unsets and resets it. Give me a different pose. What else you got? Okay, Ray, can you be a little bit more creative, please? Okay, there's not a lot of fashion poses, so let's try and fill the frame. Look at that. Lovely. The most formal wear I've ever seen. Hey, Ray, I'm going to bed. I mean, you can hang out if you want. <laughs> yeah, I'm just heading to bed, so <laughs> Ray's like, um, I, I'm still down here. Rian? Rian? Are, are you still there? I guess it's just me. <laughs> oh, there it goes. Oh, oh, he's cleaning up. Look, I, I'm telling you, I'm telling you, Ray is a sweetheart. He's cleaning up out of the mini fridge. He, oh, look, he's cleaning up that as well. Oh, do you, and I don't know if you guys have heard his voice, but it's super deep. It's like, hey guys, my name's Ray. I feel like that's pretty cool. Oh, look, and he's taking out the trash. Look at this, upstanding citizen. I'm pretty impressed. I gotta say, I'm impressed. Reading a book, he is a bookworm, that makes sense. And he put it back. Very nice. I gotta get going. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I went to bed a while ago. Are those pancakes still downstairs? Oh no, they're gone. <laughs> I guess someone cleaned them up or ate them. Hey Kenji, what's up? Roommate. Kick out. Stop that. Thanks for cleaning, probably. Thanks, buddy. I'll tell a knock knock joke. You know, I feel like as roommates, we should probably talk every so often. Hey, what's your uh, taste in decor? What do you like? Sentiment gained. You're so fun to be around. I really enjoy spending time with you. I hope you feel that way about me too. That's nice. Likes patio decor. Okay. Interesting. Romance with no one. Yeah. Kenji. Kenji is a beautiful soul. I love Kenji. I think I think he's going to remain being a very good friend of ours. Closer from happy memories. Deeply connected. Deeply connected. Very nice. So what does the green mean? Like, because it's like, is that, if it's empty, is it running out? Or is it, is that how it works? I don't really know. It doesn't really say. I don't know. Sometimes the green level changes. Anyway. Yeah, clean that up and then I guess we'll go back to sleep for a little bit because we got to meet with the style influencer. We need a little bit more money, so we should probably do that. Now, Ray is a library. What library? Did it, did it say what library Ray works at? At Lakeview Library. I think we should see if we can go visit Ray at work. That'd be kind of cute. But first, let, let me finish my work before, <laughs> before we do that. All right, go here because I got to meet with the style influencer, which I think was the same one as before. Cadence, I think it is. Yeah, meet with. Makoto, her dad became friends with Quinn. Um, she's a child? Makoto, I don't know why you know about this or why you're telling me that she's pretty cool. That's weird. If you're anything other than, no, no. Even if you were her teacher, you shouldn't be saying that. <laughs> All right, what do I gotta do? Present, presenting. All right, here's my photo. What do you reckon? You can do better than this. Why? No, I can't do better than this. This is as good as I can be. I can never do better than that, but I guess it never matters. All right, let's do our awkward selfie then. Give me a bit of fame. Here we go. Beautiful, lovely, great pose, guys. <laughs> Cadence isn't even moving when I do these. Yeah, there we go. That's nice. I like it. Got it. And I got to tell you a story as well. Funny. All right. Wait, funny introduction? I don't even know you. How do I not know you? You've been here multiple times. Cheerful introduction then. Okay. All right, funny. Uh, what do I have to do? Tell, tell, I'll tell a funny story about that. Maybe you'll like me more. There we go. All right, you can leave now. Get out of here. Give me my money. 12 grand. Thank you. 
Don't mind if I do. All right, let's go to Lakeview Library. Where is that? Lakeview. Where would there be a Lakeview and a library? Is it just Willow Creek? No, there's Willow Creek Archive. Okay, no. Oasis Springs? Wait, there's no library here. Oh, wait, is it Newcrest? Because I added a bunch of lots in here. Nope, Blossom Cafe. Okay, not that one. Del Sol? There's no lake in Del Sol Valley. There's also no library. Oh, it's Copperdale. Okay, like, like you. Okay. I was like, where the heck is Lakeview Library? All right, so in theory, Ray should be working here. Okay, they're not. There's Kayan. Ray, I came to see you. Where are you? Send a text. Where the heck are you? I came all the way to Copperdale to visit you. Actually, you know where we should go? We should go over here and give Ray a makeover. I'll travel here with, uh, not you. Oh, okay. I'll travel by myself then. Can I just, can I just go here? Why do I have to travel with? Can I even access this even though it's not mine? Like what, what's the deal with that? Whoa, it's popping off in here. Got an employee that I've never hired. I got another employee and we got three employees here. All right. Offer appearance styling, Ray. Hey, so I've been thinking, did you wanna... Uh, I mean, I'm a fashion... fashionista, you know. I could give you a little bit of a makeover. Here we go. Let's go! Makeover time! All right, well, we gotta, we gotta change that beard. Uh, those earrings gotta go. Nose, nose piercing can stay, that's all good. I just don't... Those earrings, I don't think really go with anything else. Why is this all green? Doesn't green mean he's wearing it? Wait, what's all? Oh, oh, I clearly I, <laughs> I haven't updated my mods it's since I um since the game update. Yeah, oops. Okay, that's fine. I can just ignore it. Oh no, my nose piercing. It's okay. I know where the buttons are. Should we do a little stud? No, no, no. Let's. You had a single ring before. Oh my god, I'm doing too many. Let me get rid of that. There we go. I think it was that one. Sure. Glasses. Okay, so we've got kind of medium length hair. Should we see what's in medium? Maybe we could just do like a restyle. Mm, not a lot of medium choices. Well, Ray is an adult, so I don't want to go too like young and too stylish. I was actually kind of thinking maybe this one. I feel like it's still stylish, but it looks a little bit more, like it doesn't look so young. You know what I mean? Like that looks like, I feel like that's a young man's hairstyle. <laughs> <laughs> he's actually kind of, I feel like he, he looks like such a sweet guy. I actually, I'm going to keep the, <laughs> this is his formal outfit. I actually kind of want to keep it. So I'm going to leave it. Oh my gosh. This is his party wear. <laughs> Ray knows how to party. Let's go. You know what? You're keeping it, right? That's fun. <laughs> Dang. Look at the chest hair showing off in hot weather. You know what? You can keep that top. Let's maybe just change the pants. Those ones are a little short. Actually, that's all right. Yeah, let's do that. Maybe not boots either. There you go. All right. Here's our Ray makeover. Every day. I mean, I feel like that's still age appropriate. You know, we've got this sort of plaid shirt, but then, you know, nice comfy slacks. They're like pants, not like jeans or, or like leggings or anything like that. Comfy shoes as well, because, you know, Ray's a librarian. You could probably be moving around all day, doing stuff around the library. Got to be respectable. Respectable, have comfy shoes. Obviously got the hair and the beard now. I did put a beard back on because I thought the stubble, it didn't, the stubble actually kind of seemed small because he's got really high hair. So I was like, I want to balance it out with the beard. Formal wear, like I said, I kept that. Uh, athletic wear, change it up a little bit. Sleep wear is actually the same. I just removed shoes. Party we kept for sure. Swimwear, I just sort of made the match a little bit better. Also, Ray seems to have a thing for red. He's wearing a lot of red. So we're going to, we're keeping that theme a little bit. Got the hot weather wear showing off the chest hair. And then the cold weather wear with a nice sweater um, and some boots and some jeans in this one, which I thought, you know, be a little bit warmer. Not that much warmer, but, you know, a little bit. Um, yeah, that's the makeover. Looking a million bucks. Definitely looks a little bit older as well, I think. Also, Ray is an adult, so I think that makes sense. We don't want him looking like a teenager. I, Brienne definitely needs a makeover too. But I just spent a bunch of time on that one, so I'm not going to do Brienne's right now. Maybe I'll do Brienne's like before next episode or at the beginning of next one, just so not wasting a whole bunch of time on that. Ah, oh, Colm. Hey, Colm. What can I actually buy in here, by the way? I can buy some random junk. I can buy some some of these outfits that we made. Oh, I can buy the, the shelf. Got to say, though, you are looking good, Ray. Looking good. <gasps> Oh, oh, I didn't even do it. You know what? I was literally about to click ask to be boyfriend, but Ray taking the first step. Let's go. Yes. Ray liking the makeover. Be like, wow, Brienne, you really changed my life for the better. You know, you know, uh, can we, can we like kiss or something? Celebrate the occasion or, I mean, look at this guy down here. Look at this handsome fellow. Look at that. 
I like how his everyday outfit also does have a bit of chest there. Maybe not the most professional thing for the, the librarian, but whoa! I thought it'd just be like a little pack, but you know, not too sh Aww. Yeah! Woohoo! Try for baby. No, I actually wanted to, um... Oh, can I offer Rose? Isn't that usually an option? I guess it's, I don't have that at the moment. I want to profess my undying love. No. Let's, let's, well, we, you know, we could woohoo, but maybe somewhere a little bit, you know, <laughs> maybe not in this store. Although there is a bedroom upstairs. Can I unlock that door? Can I go there? I don't think so. Oh wait, I can. Hey Ray, no, let's let's not do it in this store. <laughs> Alrighty, can I like unlock? I was kind of wish I could say specifically for Ray to get through, but I just have to unlock it, I guess. Try for baby. Wait, so let's not skip a step. Let's maybe just enjoy each other's company first. Hey Ray, you want to seal this deal? Let's go. He's like, yeah. Brianna's has learned Ray's woohoo interest. Oh, that's good. That, that could have been a deal breaker if we got this far and that wasn't compatible. Um, romantic exploration, yes. Romance, women, woohoo, men and women. Okay, very nice. Same, I think I think that's the same as Brianne. So we are compatible, which is good. That would have been, that. now that would have been sad if we became boyfriend, girlfriend, and then he's like, eh, actually, no. <laughs> All righty, let's get this show on the road. Oh, Brienne is about to woohoo for the first time. You know what? I feel like Brienne, it, it, it took a while, but I think we found someone. And everything we've seen from Ray, he seem, he does seem very nice. That's all I'm saying. He seemed very nice. I'm very happy with him. The only thing I'm a little concerned about is him becoming an elder before we get married, because I don't want that to happen. I might actually get Ray to move in, just so we can prevent that. Oh, look at this. Very happy. Oh, that's actually so cute. She's like... I finally found the right person. Oh, look, we kind of have matching pajamas too, both white. Well, I mean, it's blue too, but you know. Hey, uh, Ray, want to join household? I just want to make sure you're not going to age up and die. <laughs> Ooh, 20 grand. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Welcome. Let's go. All right. Now, first of all, what's your age like? Oh, we got time. We got 29 days. Spice Hound. Hello. And you've also got home turf. Okay. What else are you, what else, what else are you hiding in here, Ray? You want to do the Strangerville mystery? That's not happening. That's not, we're not doing that, Ray. Now, unfortunately, Ray doesn't have a job anymore because librarian isn't technically a job. So I'm wondering if we, should we pick something similar? What's similar? I would do education, but Hillary is literally doing education as well. Librarian and, hmm. <laughs> should we be a influencer? I mean, I guess we could be, a, we, we could do education as well. It's just, I feel like Brianne's doing the exact same thing. Not that it matters, I suppose. I mean, that could be nice. Not Brianne. Hillary's doing the same thing. Sorry, not Brianne. That could be nice because then Ray and Hillary could get to know each other through work. Well, through work. Obviously, they won't really, but although in growing together, they might. You know what? Let's do it. Maybe it can be a school librarian. That'll be nice. Uh, sure, I'll get a jump start. Okay, well, anyway, let's not worry about that right now. What I would like to do is... Well, actually, I don't need to worry about you aging up because we've got plenty of time, so that's actually good. Because I, I was worried because if Ray was here and became an elder, that would have been heartbreaking. But on that very romantic ending to this episode, I'm going to leave it here. I'm very happy with Ray. I hope you guys are too. I know there's a lot of passionate people in the audience that really... Well, a lot of people had their heart set on Kenji. Obviously, that's not going to work. But I think Kenji's going to be a really good friend and almost member of the family. I feel like Kenji's going to be hanging out with us. Kenji's our roommate still, so that'll be really nice. I'm really excited for that. And then we also had... There's a few other fish in the sea, but I don't know. I feel like when we were hanging out with Ray, everything was going right. None of the traits I don't like, so all the traits are good. Also, there was a ton he autonomously gave her a rose. I mean, that's all I'm saying. It's meant to be. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Make sure to leave your comments, suggestions, and feedback down below. And have an awesome day.